ok let's see here how to install metamask and how to check whether the mix works i have here a blank clean new windows installation when installing on the mac it's pretty similar um let's see uh, first of all i will have to install metamask extension let's start from chrome which usually is the one which has more difficulties okay so metamask.io what is this thing by the way probably chrome uh, download install metamask on your browser chrome ios ios android chrome thank you install metamask for chrome ok add to chrome oops sorry in the meantime i have problems on the other computer ok here it is add to chrome add exchange extension it's downloading the extension add into chrome No, I don't want to turn on sync and sync my computer, it's fine like that. Let's see, when the fox follows you, okay, get started, okay, create a wallet, I agree, password, uh, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, I agree. Not long enough. Uh, let's use my usual password. Okay. Okay, the secret words. Copy. Oh, wait. Let me open word because it's gonna ask me this word so. I have to put them somewhere. No, don't tell me that it's not going to let me yeah, copy. Can I paste them here? No, word away because not bad. Okay, let's take something simpler. Okay, file save as on my desktop. Secret meta mask phrase. Okay, and I keep it here because it will ask me this thing later on. Okay, next. Now it asks me the secret meta mask phrase. So it's love nerve deliver resource love nerve deliver resource charge thumb cluster proud charge cloud cluster uh, charge oops thumb cluster proud cut early baby crazy cut early there are people who know who remember these things by heart every day they say it uh, all done thank you Okay, it's my, my wallet, it's set up, I go on Rinkby, which is the one that we we'll use, okay. Before, however, I, on Chrome, I don't know whether this is supposed to do on Firefox, I don't think, but on Chrome, for sure, right click, okay, check that it's all sides, here, okay. Another thing that you have to check, which drove me really crazy, it took me two days to find it out from here, settings. Well, you can set something if you want, but it's not so relevant. In security and privacy. Okay, finally. Because uh, there used to be something such as, uh, let me see, uh, privacy mode here. So switch it off. If you find privacy mode, now luckily there is no more, but if you find privacy mode, switch it off. Okay, the other thing, it's pretty. Okay, done, everything, nothing interesting. Let's go to account one. You go, good. 
may go away from the settings okay let's change the test network I go to me I can close okay so I close it okay now I enter from here restart go Yoo oh fine okay the password okay here create account account true create we need three accounts in this course create account account three okay I have now three accounts very well I go back to account one okay okay very well so MetaMask works Firefox is pretty similar I will install it just to show it to you oops sorry I took the wrong Firefox let's see thank you You can, by the way, if you if you want to use both, you can import the same wallet. Otherwise, you create a brand new one. Where is my Firefox? Okay, let's iconize Chrome. Why Firefox is out of my boundaries? Oh. Okay. Now, MetaMask.io. Download Firefox. Ta ta ta. Uh, add to Firefox. Add. Takes a while. Uh, allow this extension to run in private windows well yes that doesn't doesn't matter too much okay is it there yes it's there let's see right click manage remove menu bar customize no okay nothing interesting left click with a mouse so I'm able to enter get started and now, now I will create a new wallet again but you can import if you have the secret uh, phrase otherwise you create a new one but now let's import it so I don't so I copy my words don't use my words for your wallet it's not a good idea new password It's not a good idea because also your colleagues know it and then they will play pranks on you. Uh, congratulations, all done. I have imported the wallet. I have already the accounts. Okay, let's go here. Settings to check that uh, the privacy and security are revealed situation. Okay, nothing strange. Okay, fine. This one you maybe close. close. So you keep only MetaMask here the side window okay now I switch off oh we can keep Firefox just to okay now MetaMask works I go to remix remix.ethereum.org and I have to check whether it works correctly or not remix is an IDE so it's basically a little interface to write uh, computer programs it's entirely online however so while Jupyter uses the browser but it was on your computer this is entirely online so it you cannot it, it, it is a little disadvantage that you cannot even save the files on your desktop which is pretty annoying and um, it comes up with four test uh, uh, programs and um, here if you want to use the previous version because many videos are done with the previous version you click here if you want to use the new version, I will make this here the use use the new version, but you can use the previous one. It's exactly the same. Uh, I will maybe on Firefox here keep the new version and on Chrome the previous one. So Solidity, click, click again. Okay, click two times. Okay, okay. 
Now you have to go, you have the interesting things are here. File Explorers, look at your file. This one, skip. Ah, it's a solidity compiler, so it's not skip. To compile your program. And this one, deploy. Okay. Pay attention because sometimes you see also the symbol of Viber. But we don't want to use it. So it's the files, the solidity compiler, compile, deploy. But what does it mean, compile? Uh, solidity is a compile programming language, while Python is interpreted. Interpreted for Python means that you can run every single line, you can run a piece of it every time the computer checks whether everything is written properly in case it gives you an error. Compile have a different philosophy. The computer first must check that everything is okay. When everything is okay, you can use your program. So first you have to compile. Compile means basically checking that everything is okay and building what is technically called the ABI, okay, which is not the Italian Bank Association, uh, but it's another thing. So it's a program in machine language. Then you can deploy it. Deploy means that you load it on the Ethereum blockchain. Okay, so here, file for example, double click on storage.sol. Sol is extension for. Uh, I don't like this color particularly, so I go here on settings and I change settings. Pay attention because the light settings can be really flashing, as you see. You probably were sleeping while watching this video and I woke you up. I like the superhero dark. Okay, this is my favorite one. Uh, I spend one hour obviously tying all of them. Um, okay, so program okay here you see black and um, probably for the video it's not the best one is there any way to increase the font for you let's see ta, 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 text wrap token ta, 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 ta. a lot of uh, useless things but not increase the font no always increase ta, ta, ta. No, there's no way to increase the font Okay, or probably we'll discover sooner or later. Okay, anyway, it is a little example of Solidity program. It has only six lines. Okay, uh, just to check that your uh, remix is working correctly. You go here, uh, you check the compiler is 0.61, the compiler version. It needs a compiler of at least 4.22 and no more than 7. Okay, fine. Click compile. Okay, when you see contract written here, it got compiled correctly. Okay. Now, completion successful. Now go here. To deploy. Okay, wait. Okay, first of all, we try to deploy on JavaScript VM. I don't explain what it is. It will be explained later on. However, this is a little blockchain which is only on your computer. The JavaScript virtual machine, it's a little blockchain which, however, exists only on your computer, so it's not a blockchain. Uh, you try to deploy it. Okay, done. It's done. Okay, you have basically an unlimited, uh, you have several accounts and uh, a lot of Ethereum. Um, Let's see now a uh, more interesting injected Web3. In order to use it, you must first check that your MetaMask is active and the password is inside. Okay, very well. Uh, unfortunately, we don't have either. So, ta -ta -ta. choose injected Web3 and hope for the best. Okay, Metamask will ask you the permission to connect Remix with Metamask. You say connect. Okay, now here you should see at least your current Metamask account. 0xA0F. 0xA0F. Yes, it's my account. Okay. Uh, unfortunately, it doesn't have either, so I cannot test whether I am able to deploy things on the blockchain because that cost gas I remind you and they must pay in either so uh, for the moment it's uh, okay but however this one it was the difficult thing uh, okay mm, that's it uh, for remix uh, let's see the very same thing on chrome on chrome we use the old interface so let's iconize this one this one I don't need them anymore 
Oh, this is still Firefox. Come. So, remix.ethereum.org. Okay, I'll use the previous version. Uh, okay, we have to reload. Okay, it tells me that it's uh, not updated. MetaMask immediately asks me where I want to connect uh, Remix with uh, MetaMask. Very well, yes, sure. Okay, not uh, connected. Uh, okay, let's see. Okay, first of all, browser. Browser, it's the explorer. Ballot test. Does it work? Ballot. What do we take? Take ballot. We don't have the other ones. Can you see here are the file files. Ballot. No, I don't want to switch to new interface. Start to compile. Yes, when you see here, the green thing, it's compiled. Okay. Then run. Go on run. Okay. First of all, we try on JavaScript virtual machine. So you own your local, um, and you press deploy. Okay. Done. Can you see here the green light? Then I try on injected web three. The important thing is that you see here your address. Currently has zero either, so I can't. I cannot deploy to test it because you must have either to deploy. Okay. Uh, so, uh, however, it works. This is the new, the old interface. Basically, we will use always compile, run, and the browser here, and it, which corresponds to the other one. To, this is the browser of the files. The browser, sorry, file list, the compile, and the deploy. What is the other one? Is called run, deploy, run transactions. Okay, these are the things concerning Remix and, uh, and uh, Metamask. Metamask, goodbye.